Hello, friends and family. It's your boy Destiny. We're back here with a brand new edition of Honestly Very Big. Thank you to all my subscribers. If this is the first time joining us on this platform, please don't forget to smash that subscribe button. Don't forget to like and leave a comment down below. Today, we're going to be talking about the hyenas in Ethiopia. Because uh, basically, in different countries, there are different animals that are like normal to see. Maybe on the streets or anything. So, for today, we're going to be talking about Ethiopia and the things, the animals that are basically common in Ethiopia are just um, horses, you know, donkeys, you see a lot of cats, you see dogs. But the one that really, really blew my mind was hyena, bro. Like, literally, you don't see them like in the open. Uh, they mostly come out at night, though, but not in the major cities. Though it's in the major city, but not like as rampant as you see dogs or the rest. But at night, you do hear their sound and everything. And if you go to the bushy areas, you might likely see some. But in the rural parts of Ethiopia, it's normal to see hyenas. You understand? mostly at night but it's somehow rare to see them in the daytime but at night it's basically normal because when i travel to negili uh at about like six seven o'clock right yeah it's seven o'clock i started hearing some sounds because basically i've never seen uh aina like face to face before like so i started hearing some sound and i was told that was aina so I was like what really so and i was asked if i want to go see them and i was like no i'm not doing this like if you know me i see even when i go to the zoo i'm that kind of person that i like to keep my distance like no <sighs> too many drama I, i've watched too many horror movies to just put myself in that type of a situation so i don't I, I don't really play like that so i said no i don't want to see them because i'm literally scared of them but to the ethiopian people it's normal it's a normal thing like you it's uh, 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 it's quite difficult to see any casualties with the hyenas when i say casualties i mean uh when people tend to think like oh hyenas normally they are uh wild animals and people be like oh if it's normal to see hyenas everywhere in ethiopia don't they bite these people don't they like attack the people and everything but um to my greatest shock the people there told me that no it's 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 quite rare to see um an hyena attack or something and because the people there they are used to it even if they come in close contact with an hyena they know what to do you get me like it's it's something like they are used to like the, it's normal for them like for outsiders who be like oh no we're scared but them the ethiopians they know what to do and basically there was a video i saw where uh people go to this hyena park there's a, a man the hyena man you go there um the man basically uh, give meat to a hyena with sticks and everything and they just put it like somewhere sometimes he put the sticks on his mouth and the hyena take the meat from him something like that so i want to do a reaction to that video but first of all i just want you all to know that the uh people say oh no hyena saba this da 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 for the ethiopians it's a normal thing and it's not what you see on the road on the street no it's not like that it's paid you most times at night and not in the major cities maybe in the rural part of ethiopia and um it's 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 a normal thing for them the same way you see cats and dogs in your place lizards and everything for them it's normal and um to my knowledge and i because i asked a lot of questions and they said no they don't just um attack people so so to say so um it is what it is i don't really know but i really love you guys to educate me more in the comment section so just tell me how it is so Without wasting so much of a time, guys, let's get on to the Let's go. In the Hara part of Ethiopia, okay? Oh, bro. This was the exact sound I was hearing. Bro. What the. Uh... Guys, these are literally these are wild animals, bro. Seriously, like. Whoa. Ah. Huh? He's not even scared, bro. Like. 
Nah, bro. Man, this thing's are huge, bro. Oh, <laughs> ah! What is Bro. Nah, I don't play like this, bro. Nah. Nah, bro. <laughs> nah, bro. <laughs> Seriously. Bro. Seriously, I literally have nothing to say like bro What nah that was really close bro 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 this is literally scary bro this is literally scary bro If you know you know like first of all I don't play like this like I'm the kind of person who never see in this type of place Yes I know it's not uh do they are wild animals but they don't attack people like that because as you can see he was trying to like give them food and everything and bro but me i don't see i don't play like that bro in nigeria i would say rough play i don't see i know they like that kind of rough play bro first of all i would just give my distance yes i, I can just i can do a tape from afar and just try to zoom in and everything but bro coming in, in contact with them like that he even went as far as putting the bro <laughs> no bro nah bro i don't want to pee my pants bro and that and that's just facts because see life life is too precious <laughs> see <laughs> and there was one part where he was doing the like okay you want to give you want to give uh, even even a human being you want to give me food you are doing me like this doing me like this doing me like this at the point in time i'll just drag it from you right so imagine what the Ahina would do. I, like, I, this is just my own thinking. I don't know. I, I, you get me? Like, nah, bro. I, I can't put myself in this type of situation, bro. But seriously, you know, Ethiopians, they are just, they, they're just another type of, bro. The Ethiopians, they're just on their own level. I always say this, and people think, oh, maybe I'm exaggerating, oh, no, blah, blah, bro. But it's the truth. I posted a video the other day where some uh, Ethiopians were riding lions back in the days, bro. Who, like, in Nigeria, they do they, they do stuff like this too, you get me? Um, they sit on the hyenas, they, they, this one, like, the hyenas are on chains and everything, but not like this, feeding the hyenas with your teeth, bro. Nah. Nah, bro, like, bro. Like, but first of all, you y'all just have to go visit Ethiopia and see how it is. Because I always say this, people think I'm joking. Go for yourself. There are different tourist attractions you can go to, different places, different lovely places. The, the country as a whole is, 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 to me, is like home, bro. Though I'm Nigerian, but I see Ethiopia as my second home, bro. Because the country is literally blessed with everything you can think of, bro. Like, what like, like what are you looking for? They have it all, bro. They literally have everything, bro. It is what it is. It was a nice video, but I will never try this, bro. It is what it is. That's it, guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. Till next time, I remain your boy, Destiny. And we out.